Delta T devices, research grade measurement of solar radiation. The SPN1 pyranometer offers a radically different approach to solar radiation measurement. Traditionally, the measurement of global, direct and diffuse solar radiation has required complex, expensive equipment. In contrast, the SPN1 offers similar performance, but has no moving parts, is compact and easy to set up, and requires no adjustment during use, saving time and cost. The SPN1 measures global radiation from the whole of the sky and simultaneously measures diffuse radiation, excluding the direct solar beam. It also provides sunshine duration and enables calculation of DNI, direct normal irradiance. Its innovative design features seven thermopile sensors, a computer-modeled shadow mask, a precision ground glass dome, a robust machined aluminium case, and an internal heater. So how does it work? The position of these seven thermopiles in combination with the shape of the shadow mask ensures that one thermopile is always in the direct solar beam and one is in shade. So at any given moment at least one thermopile is measuring direct radiation and at least one is measuring diffuse radiation. The SPN1 connects to data loggers, computers and control systems. Data can be viewed remotely using Delta Link Cloud, Delta T's cloud-based data service. Let's look at the SPN1 in action over 12 hours. The radiation and sunshine status data can be seen on the right of the screen as the sun rises and descends through clouds. The SPM-1 has a wide range of uses. Let's look first at commercial solar PV. To compare solar panel efficiency to DNI, it's common practice to use expensive mechanical equipment that tracks the sun. The SPN1 calculates DNI without the mechanical complexity and at lower cost. Dependable solar radiation data is vital for the selection of new solar farm sites and for efficiency monitoring at established sites. The SPN1's high quality and affordability make it an excellent choice for these measurements. Now let's look at meteorology and other scientific applications. The SPN1 enables solar radiation and DNI to be monitored at hostile and remote sites, where regular shadow band adjustment would be virtually impossible. The built-in heater keeps the dome clear from condensation and ice down to minus 20 degrees C. The SPN1's compactness and speed of response has seen it mounted on a variety of craft and it can be used to estimate total optical depth and aerosol optical depth as an affordable alternative to sun photometers. Let's review the many advantages of the SPM-1. Multiple accurate outputs. No moving parts. Compact and rugged. An internal heater. And versatile communication options. Visit www.delta-t.co.uk for more details.